going to be prepared for a mission. Now let's make this quick so that you'll all understand what I am saying. Now everyone, I have some good news and bad news. What's the good news, King? The good news is, is that somebody has found a glowing sphere for us. And there he is. I believe you're looking for this. A glowing sphere. How did you know this guy found it? I know everything I feel. So what's the bad news? The bad news is that we have lost Larkon, that Shadow Matorn of ours, to that Toa of Air who has one leg but no feet. And he's been brought back with the other Toa, and his legs was also brought back too. Impossible. How is a Toa with no legs able to beat a Shadow Matorn who has one arm? Apparently, what I sensed was, is that Larkon fell to an abyss and said that he would take the Toa there with him. But then, that Toa there lost his weapon just by dropping Larkon down the abyss. And that Shadow Matorn is gone forever. So that Toa lost his wind thrower. So now that Toa is unarmed and legless. Is that right? No, it's not. Because like I said before, that Toa got his legs back. Not only did he get his legs back, but he now has a new weapon. The Airlander is his new weapon. True, son. True. And with that Airlander welded by that toe of air, that is now our new target. Now, we must find a way to separate the Airlander and that Toa. And when we do, we will kill that Toa. Now, are you all with me to find that Toa of Air and kill him? Of course, we're with you, King Valka. We're with you to kill that Toa. We are also coming with you too. I'm also joining the fight to kill that Toa, if you insist. Then it is settled. We find that Toa there and kill him, once and for all. Ah, a glowing sphere. I did it. I found one of them. Hollow must have dropped one and forgotten all about it. Sphere belongs to me. Well, I was here first, so back off, Scotty. Well, that sphere is still mine, and you'll have nothing to do about it. Uh, hey, who's that? Duh! Whoever it is, you put me down. Tisk, tisk, tisk. Whoever knew a Paraka would be so small? You dare call Necton small? I am not small, you imbecile! Well, you look like it to me because you don't look the same size as Vizon. Quick, Toa, let's get back to the others with the Golden Sphere. That wouldn't be necessary. We have came for that glowing sphere. So either you give it up, or I will chop you up. We'll also be taking the Toa of Air with us. At long last, 
We have finally found you. It looks as though you have changed all of a sudden, Toa. Is it the armor? And probably the weapon? Why, of course! You never heard of the Airlander? <laughs> Finally you put me down! You'll both be dead if you don't take that weapon off of that Matoran. Like how? You're still going to get shot anyway. Like this. Um, uh, not exactly as I expected. Okay, if you weren't expecting that, then were you expecting this? Ooh, absolutely not. I don't know about you, but I'm getting out of here! All those Toa are your problem now! The rest of the Toa de Pambus. We can't take them all down. We have been outnumbered. We must get out of here. And so we should. You win, Toa. But someday, we will get you and the glowing spheres. Yeah, you try. But we will find the other two before you do. Oh, they'll try, all right. Until they find out they can only find two of them. Because we have one of them. Thanks to you for recovering the glowing sphere. We must now find the second one before those Toa find it. They already have that glowing sphere, but we have the other. So that leaves one glowing sphere to find. Let's go.